I think we should get together. We should break up. Socks. We should get back together. I think we should break up. Socks. Socks. Welcome to my channel, Reviews with Jules. If you're new here, make sure to click that subscribe button. And today, I am going to be discussing everything you need to know about BBC and Hulu's Normal People. So, let's get into it. Normal People is a Sally Rooney adaptation. It's 12 episodes of around 30 minutes in length, and it's available on BBC iPlayer and Hulu. Normal People is a classic will they won't they storyline and it follows Mary Ann and Connell who are attending the same high school in Sligo in Ireland. Now his mum is her mum's maid so they often see each other outside of school time and they start to develop this really endearing sincere relationship. However it is kept secret because Mary Ann is the typical high school loner and Connell is this popular one of the lads group. So obviously they keep it secret but then that does take its toll and they break up. However Later on, they both attend the same university in Dublin and through fate, they meet each other again. And the whole series thereafter just follows the makeup and breakup and trials and tribulations of their relationship. Normal People has been praised for its authenticity and representation of a modern couple. And that is what I liked most about the series, but also the sex scenes, and there were many, were so realistic. And I think that's because of the intimacy coordinator that they worked with, which I see a lot of film and TV production companies working with now. And if you're interested to hear more about that, I have put some links to some articles in the description below for you to check that out. What I also liked about the series was that they were intelligent lead characters because all you're seeing in the media now are shows like Too Hot to Handle, which you can see my review now, and Love Island. And I think we're getting a really tainted vision of what love and coupling means. So I think it's really refreshing to have a drama like this on our screens. But having said that, I wouldn't particularly say that it was revolutionary TV. I think that it was really a sweet piece, but 12 episodes of 30 minutes doesn't sound long, but it felt like a lifetime. Now, some people have said that might be to feel like it is normal people. But I also think if you're doing a drama, you get the sense that they are normal people. And I don't think you need to really hinder the pace. And I really felt like it was really dragged out and slow. And that was one of the things that held it back for me. The most interesting thing surrounding normal people for me was the discussion around it. Me, as a female, I felt more sorry for Connell, but then I was speaking to some males who felt more sorry for Mary Ann. So what I want you to do is click on this poll just over here and tell me who you felt more sorry for so we can put this to bed once and for all. Because they're in bed. A lot. Talking a little bit about the characters now, Mary Ann, as I had said before, is a classic high school loner and sometimes she can come off a little bit pretentious and rude, but I feel like that is just a bit of a front and she really is her true self when she's around Connell. Speaking of which, Connell, although initially in the lad and popular group, isn't actually one of the lads himself. He is a very sweet boy who is very intelligent and seems to be his most authentic self when he is with Marianne. Normal People is a bitter, sweet, romantic TV series, which I gave three jewels. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and I'd love to hear what you thought of the series in the comments below, so I'll see you there. But next week, I am going to be reviewing Netflix's Never Have I Ever. So make sure that you click that alarm bell so you do not miss out on that. And in the meantime, check out these reviews right over here. See you later.